Welcome back to another stupid fast tutorial you may have to rewind. Transitions don't have to be linear. You can customize the easing. Let me show you what that means. In DaVinci Resolve, if you click on a cut and then hit Command T on a Mac, you'll add a basic cross dissolve. And this is where most people stop and it's where I've stopped. But what I accidentally just found out is if you click on the transition, a diamond appears. It's a keyframe icon. If you click on that, then you get more options to add Bezier curves. So if we click on this Bezier curve icon here, we can see our linear transition. If we select both the start and the end points and then hit the ease and out button, we now have a cross dissolve that is easing in and then easing out. And you can customize each point further by dragging the Bezier handle to your liking. And you can see that reflected here. Bonus points, you can now right click on the transition and you can do create transition preset. You can name that anything and then it will show up in your effects library. Now, something you need to keep in mind though is that this works for all of the basic transitions, meaning that if you have custom transitions or fusion transitions, you'll be limited to the options in the inspector tab, basically anything that has a triangle or diamond next to it. But all of these other basic transitions, if we drag that on here, we can then click that diamond and we have our Bezier curves. If you enjoyed this, follow for more.